What is up, Hellions, and welcome to another dollar store pack opening video where every pack is one dollar. I, I really like these videos because you never know what you're going to get out of a dollar store pack. You can get anything from whatever particular set you happen to be opening. And today, we're going to be opening not only $10 store booster packs, but we're also going to be opening some packs that also have a mystery card in them. I'm pretty excited about those because apparently that could be just about anything from your most mundane trainer card to a holographic Charizard from base set for all I know. So that'll be super interesting to see if we get anything cool out of those mystery cards. Just a quick update for you guys before we get started. I wanted to let you know that Shining Fates is coming out next month on the 19th of February and I do have 22 packs one of each tin and one pikachu v box i've got those pre-ordered so i will have packs to open on the day and there will be a video that evening of shining fates opening here on the channel also i've got a ton of cards out at cgc multiple charizards a bunch of new cards for vivid voltage that should be coming back either early to mid february which i'm also very excited uh, to open those up and see what they get. I've never graded a card before, so I don't know what to expect, but I'm hoping for some good results. Lastly, and you know what I'm gonna say, if you enjoy the video today, please remember to hit the like and subscribe button. It really helps me out a ton, and we're trying to hit that thousand subscribers so that we can really beef up the channel here, beef up the community aspect of the channel, and hitting that thousand subs kind of gives you a lot more options on YouTube to be able to do those things. So if you enjoy the video today, please hit the like button. That helps me out with the, the weird YouTube algorithm, getting my video out there to more people, and uh, obviously hit the subscribe if you're not already subscribed. All right, guys, let's do what we're here to do. Let's crack some packs, baby. Okay, so like I said, we have our 10 packs that I typically open on these dollar store videos. Uh, luckily, my dollar store actually was able to get more packs in. They've been sold out for the last few weeks. So they were finally able to get some more packs in. We got some Unbroken Bonds, a very fun set to open, especially in the dollar packs. It seems like I have some pretty good luck with Unbroken Bonds and getting some Ultra Rares, which is very, very nice. I'm very excited to open these. And these are the things that are new that I've never opened before. These packs are exclusive to Dollar General and you get two booster packs and a mystery card. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open these set the mystery cards aside until the end of the video and then we'll look at the mystery cards and see if we get anything good now it does say on the back that the one bonus card approximate odds per pack of finding special bonus cards special promo cards one in six so interesting foil or rare one of 25 what do they mean by promo card then <laughs> because a foil or a rare you would think would have less odds than a special promo card which would have higher or higher odds i don't know what i'm saying and original chase cards one in three thousand i don't know if that means original chase cards to the sets that are in here or to just anything in general also look for the original base card of charizard blastoise bulbasaur venusaur and more hell yeah so there's possibility we could get some base set cards as a mystery card but probably let, let's keep our let's keep our expectations low okay as we open these uh because i'm assuming we're gonna not get something crazy I, or we're i'm going in with low expectations and hopefully i'm blown away by something amazing but we're gonna keep our expectations to a minimum on these um i don't know if anyone's had any luck with these in the past please feel free to let me know in the comments I've never opened these before. They were the only dollar store anything that I could find for a couple weeks. So they've been sitting on the shelf just chilling. But we do have a Breakpoint and a Guardian's Rising of these. And then we have 10 Unbroken Bonds. So I'm going to start with the Unbroken Bonds. Just get those ones out of the way. And then we will open the Guardian's Rising. And those awesome bonus cards. All right. So guys, important to remember. I say it in most of my dollar store videos. But... You do want to make sure that if you're buying dollar store packs that you ask them at the front if someone comes in and weighs the packs. You can weigh these packs to figure out if there's a hollow or something good in there. And uh, you need to make sure uh, with the clerks and everything that you have not, um, that they have not seen anyone weighing the packs. Because you don't want your chances completely destroyed of getting something good. <laughs> 
uh, right out the gate. So, also, there are no code cards in this, which makes them weighable. That's why they're weighable. And the middle card will always be your good card if you're going to get a good card. It'll be the middle card. So, just move that middle card to the back if you want to do a little fun card trick. And then uh, lick a tongue and lit in and a fire energy. Okay. Starting off. Starting off typical. <laughs> starting off pretty typical. That's what I'll say. Very interesting that these don't have... I guess because they're uh, probably like a newer a newer print run. They don't have the code cards. But I think the other one that I opened did have uh, code cards. Sorry. Diglett, Fairy Charm Energy, and Zubat. Okay. Here we go. That middle card to the back. We've got... Spiro, Spiro, Lieutenant Surge Strategy, and Crobat. Wait, oh, Crobat Hollow, okay, which is a rare. So we got a Hollow rare. That's pretty awesome. Crobat. We actually have this card. We opened this. Uh, we opened a Crobat Hollow in a uh, Unbroken Bonds pack in another Dollar Store pack video, I think, actually, which is pretty cool. One of our better Dollar Store pack videos. All right, middle card to the back, and. We have a Meowth, an Energy, and a Grubbin. I don't get too many Energies. This is probably the most I've gotten. Um, but, you know, it's up to you. Rattata, Lairon, and Marowak. Is that a rare? That is a rare. Okay, Marowak. We've got two rares. We've got Marowak and Crobat. Pretty awesome. If you think about it, 10 packs is $10, so that's about two and a half retail packs of the 10 card packs. So you kind of want to get like two to three rares is about, you know, would be it from a typical pack. So when you're opening these dollar store uh, packs, it's if you get two to three rares, that that's pretty, that's pretty solid. That's pretty solid. Goldine, another energy, very strange, and a reverse Inke. Okay, reverse hollow Inke. Darumaka. Green's Exploration and Panda. Okay. All right. We're coming down on our uh, Unbroken Bonds packs. We got two rares so far. One hollow and one reverse. Pretty solid. I went into GameStop today and paid off my pre-order for uh, Shining Fates. So I'm very excited. Oh, War Turtle. Okay, buddy. I like that one with the giant wave behind him. That's pretty sick. War Turtle. Salandit. And coughing. Coughing, coughing. I paid off my Shining Fates pre order, so I'm very excited for that to come in um, to open those. And I pre ordered a ton of battle styles. I got like a booster box and two of each trainer uh, ETB. So we're going to have a lot of fun uh, when that comes out as well. Some really cool looking cards in that set. Let me know um, which card you're most looking forward to. I think for me, the alternate art, I think alternate art or secret rare or whatever they happen to be, the Tyranitar looks amazing where he's sleeping on the log. There we go. Ghastly, Dodrio, and Arvana. All right, we've got one pack left. Togepi, Metapod, and Miss Megus, which I'm assuming is a rare. Okay, sweet. So we did get three rares, which is awesome. That is about what you'd want to see. So I don't want to see the bonus card. I want to save the bonus card for last. I think the bonus card is facing the cardboard. So if we can get it open and not show ourselves the bonus card. I can't see it. There's the bonus card. I don't know what it is. We're just going to leave it there for now. And we are going to open our two Guardians Rising packs i don't really know much about guardians rising i don't know like what the what the uh the fire pulls in uh guardians rising are not sure but hopefully something cool all right so this is what I, i'm used to seeing uh i think with the new reprint of unbroken bonds uh they got rid of these but this is basically it's just an advertisement card it doesn't it doesn't act the same as a code card where it kind of gives weight to the pack. It's just a little advertisement card that they all have. So it's not—it's nothing really special. Um, these packs are probably a little older, so they still have that card in them. All right, we've got Slowpoke, Gliscor, and Machop. Machop. Machop, a Machoka, Machamp. Machampion's Path. 
I'm so glad I'm... Okay, so I haven't gotten the shiny Charizard yet uh, from Champion's Path, but I have gotten the rainbow Charizard. Uh, so I kind of feel like I might be done with Champion's Path. <gasps> I don't know if you guys saw it. I saw something. Did you see it? Oh, buddies. I saw something. There's a little glint. There's a little glint. Ooh, cool. All right, we've got a Beldum. A Fairy Energy. And... Oh, Metagross GX! Yeah, baby! Yes, dude! All right. We got a freaking Ultra Rare. And it's a Metagross. I love Metagross. He's so awesome. This card actually looks really good, too. Be proud of me. I actually have sleeves. Dude, Metagross. I love, absolutely love hitting Ultra Rares in dollar store packs. It's one of the one of the main reasons I still open these packs is because hitting an Ultra Rare in a dollar store pack, that is really awesome. It looks really good. Super happy we got an Ultra Rare uh, out of the dollar store pack. Sick. That is awesome. Metagross GX. We'll put that next to the, uh, the bonus card. So this is Breakpoint. And I think that there's a really cool card that I actually just sold on eBay. Um, that is a Mega Gyarados EX or GX from Breakpoint. All right, our bonus cards. We're going to set those over there. We're going to let them ruminate. We're going to let them turn into Charizards. <laughs> That's where we're going we're gonna to leave them over there and let them uh, let them sit there and turn into Charizards. We've got Tim Pole. Nuzleaf. Whoa! Ho -ho! What the hell is this? <laughs> Dragalga? Okay. I'll take it. It's a it's a hollow. A hollow rare. Dragalga. What? Why do I feel like I've never seen this Pokemon? Oh. It evolves from the seahorse thing. Is this Sun and Moon? It's been a little while since I've played Sun and Moon or or uh is it it's X breakpoint is x and y is this is this an x and y pokemon it's been a long time since i played either of those games so i do not remember this guy but that's a really sick looking card all right we're having pretty good luck actually from just the normal packs in these uh in these bonus card two packs that is pretty dang nice our last actual pack before we take a look at the bonus cards we have Petalil, Delinquent, and Skaroopy. All right. Okay. That is it for our packs. But we have two, two magical bonus cards. They could be anything. They also look like they're in really kind of terrible condition. So <laughs> let's flip the first one. Drum roll, please. A potion. A potion. From Evolutions. A potion from Evolutions. Not a Charizard. Not a Char... Okay, we have one more chance. We have one more chance to get a Charizard. A freaking potion from Evolutions. Come on. All right, one more chance to get a Charizard. Here we go. Here we go, guys. A Gallade Spirit Link. What are these bonus cards? All right, guys, that is it for me. Let me know in the comments below the best pull that you've ever gotten out of a dollar store pack. And if you like opening dollar store packs, would you rather save up your money and buy a $4 regular pack or would you rather buy four dollar store packs? Let me know in the comments below what you think of dollar store packs. And I hope you had a fantastic time today in the video. I sure did. We pulled some great cards and I always love pulling those GX, those ultra rares, out of dollar store packs they just they, how, how, what would the kids say it they hit different <laughs> they hit different all right guys i hope you have a fantastic rest of your night remember to like and subscribe if you like the video today and hellions we'll see you on the next video